YouTube. I am coming out here to give you guys a weight loss update. I am exhausted. As you can see, I am doing a car video because I am busy and I'm tired. Oh God, I'm so tired. I just got through cutting my grass. It took me 93 minutes. I did it in pretty much like 30 minute increments because I have a half an acre. Yeah, that was not a smart idea buying a house to get a house that has a half an acre of grass. <sighs> not the best idea and I have a push mower <laughs> it ain't got no it ain't self propelled I seriously need to invest in a riding lawnmower but the funny thing is my yard is, has such an incline I don't know if you can ride that I, I don't know but anyway to the weight loss update as I told you guys I was going to give you a video whether it was good bad or ugly about my weight loss uh, because I had gotten off track in the month of April just from stress and stuff in life just happens and so it was just it was a bad month and so i didn't fall completely off the wagon but i had gained a couple of pounds well y'all i'm only one pound away from being back to where i was at <laughs> so i'm almost back in what i feel like is weight loss mode because right now i'm playing catch up so um yeah i'm doing good i'm almost almost there um see what have I eaten today because I know I usually tell y'all what I've eaten and I'm not gonna make this no long video um I had scrambled eggs with mozzarella cheese on them and two pieces of turkey bacon for breakfast um I had a Greek yogurt peach parfait uh for a snack um yesterday I made um I don't know if, you're, if you all have ever heard of it but they have this crust that you can make for pizza it's mozzarella cheese, cream cheese, almond flour, egg, and then you put in like oregano, basil, um, garlic, salt, and you bake it at 425, I believe. And um, I usually flip it halfway through. You're supposed to bake it for 10 minutes, so I'll uh, bake it on one side for five minutes. It's a pain in the tail to flip. It'd be good if I had two, pan, two uh, pizza pans, but I don't. So then I'll flip it bake the other side for five minutes then you put your pizza sauce your meat your cheese all that so i cooked that yesterday and i did um turkey sausage mushrooms bell peppers and pepperoni um and so that was dinner last night and that was also lunch today um and then i had some cottage cheese as a snack i have not eaten dinner and i probably won't eat dinner um, I did have a sugar-free popsicle because I was cutting grass and I was hot. Um, so yeah, that's what I've had to eat today. Um, some days I just flat out don't eat dinner because it gets late and I don't feel like it. I feel like I shouldn't be eating nothing majorly heavy once it's late. So sometimes I just flat out don't eat dinner. Um, my exercise today was cutting at yard. I knew I was going to cut the grass today. So uh, I didn't feel the need or desire to try to walk because I knew I was going to be walking my butt off. Um, typically, Monday through Friday, I get at least um, 30 minutes of walking in at work because I we get two 15-minute breaks. And so usually at 10 o'clock and 2 o'clock, I'll go outside and I'll walk for 15 minutes to get to one of those breaks. Um, so that's typically my exercise. And then sometimes, just depending on what's going on at home, I'll jump on the treadmill. Oh, what do they call that mess? Uh, Non-scale victory. They call it like NSB or something like that. Non-scale victory. Y'all, okay, so I have a treadmill in my house. So I see it in my eye. I have a treadmill in my house. And um, I tried to do the workout one, the preset workout. Y'all, I tried to do that thing um, when I first got the treadmill. And mind you, I was like 40 pounds heavier. I thought I was going to die. Like, no lie, I got about 10 minutes into it and just pushed out. Couldn't do it. Y'all, I did it the other day. And I still had did those two 15-minute uh, breaks, too. So, overall, I had had about, I think I ended up with, like, 45 minutes of walking or something like that. But, yeah, y'all, I was able to actually do it. Um, it was a little tough at the midpoint because that's when, like, they really the workouts like really really increased to kind of you know get the heart rate going so it was a little um a little tough in that little spot but other than that it was uh it was pretty good 
So I'm proud of myself because I couldn't do that before. So my goal is to be able to do all those preset workouts eventually. And granted, the, um, I think that one was like 20 minutes. And as you keep going and getting better at working out, the uh, workouts get longer and more intense. So I was really happy about that. Um, so yeah, I'm just, it's the month of May. It's a new month. It's a new beginning. And I'm just looking at it like real positive. Um, <laughs> Mother's Day is next week. Um, so I don't know if I'll post one next week. I'm going to try to, but I know Mother's Day is coming. So we'll see. But if I don't post a video on your mother, happy Mother's Day, sweetie. Because them babies can't do it without you. And if your kids is grown, happy Mother's Day to you too. Because I'm pretty sure you got grandbabies or something. Or your kids is getting on your nerves. Happy Mother's Day. <laughs> but um that is all I really have for y'all I'm going to do my best to try to make a video next week because I want to get back and just kind of hold myself accountable and get these videos done but that's why y'all are getting the car video because I'm making a quick run and when I get home I gotta do homework because I got homework for tomorrow so uh I gotta get some stuff cranking um with that computer that laptop it's gotta get to typing so I figured I'd catch y'all in the car while I'm making this quick run. Ooh, girl. Can't talk sometimes. So, thank you guys so much for watching and coming along with this weight loss journey with me. Um, we gonna get there. Uh, and here's the funny thing. If I can get back to where I was at, I can still technically lose 10 pounds in the month of May. <laughs> and be on track with my weight loss goal. Look at the Lord. So, we're going to really, really work on this and really, really work on getting on track because I need to. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you guys, hopefully, fingers crossed, next week. Um, yeah. And I know it probably looks a little darker. It's uh, like 8.30 at night. And it's starting to get a little dark outside in Kansas City. And y'all, guess what? Spring finally showed up. It's like 77 degrees. I had to cut the air on in the house. Way off topic. But I'm just excited because I hate the winter. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will catch you guys next week. Bye.